Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. I am back with a new video and in today's video I'm gonna do a makeup tutorial as always but this time I'm gonna do a pink toned makeup tutorial so it's a color that I don't usually use so I'm gonna take my Too Faced Sweet Peach palette here and I'm gonna do a pink look a very very pinky look I think so let's get started okay so I am gonna start by taking the color Georgia the light pinky color here I'm gonna take that on a fluffy brush and apply this all over my crease as always transition shade So today I'm supposed to receive my ring, like selfie ring light that I ordered on Amazon and I'm like super excited because it's a silly little thing but since I moved to the UK I don't have, like you can clearly see on my videos, on the couple of videos I put up where I'm filming in the UK. You can see that my lighting background and everything is really not good. And I'm hoping to be able to use this little light and put it like on my on my on my camera or something and be able to to have a little bit of a better lighting thanks to that and also for my for my pictures for Instagram. So now I'm gonna take the color Candid Peach. This one here. I'm gonna take that with the same brush and apply it in the crease also. So I've decided to make a, a pink look because tomorrow is Valentine's Day and Val Valentine's Day is all about pink and, and red usually and uh, I don't know I see pink pinky things and red things all over the internet lately uh, because of Valentine's Day and I've just um, it's a color that I never use I never ever 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 wear pink and it's not really one of my favorite color but I don't know lately I've been wanting to use a bit more a bit more shades bit more colors that I don't usually wear precisely so yeah I hope it's gonna turn out good we shall see So now just to define the crease a bit more, I'm going to take a bit of a darker color and I'm going to take Summer Yum. I'm going to take another fluffy brush that is just a little bit um, smaller and I'm going to apply this on the outer portion of my eyes here and a little bit in the crease, just a little bit to define the eyes and the crease a bit more. I want my I want my line here on the outer corners of my eyes to be a little bit more a little bit sharper. I'm gonna take a bit of a translucent powder, this one by MAC, and I'm gonna take I'm gonna take a flat brush like that, dip it in the pot and Place it on the car on the outer corners of my eyes here. I'm 
I've seen this trick on on Jacqueline Hill's uh, YouTube channel and it's really really useful I do that all the time now well not all the time but every time I want a sharp look really defined and everything like that um, I do this it's a really good trick now I'm gonna take the from the electric palette by Urban Decay I'm gonna take the colors Savage 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 this one here this pink one here I'm gonna take this Okay, so now with a flat brush, a little flat brush, I am going to take the color Just Peachy here and I'm going to apply this on my leads, my lids, my lids, my leads. So I've got this Fardell uh, makeup, professional art makeup um, uh, pigment, which is a uh, darkish pink color, and I've never ever used it before, so I don't really know how it's gonna end up looking like. But I think I'm gonna apply a bit of this on my leads on top of the just peachy that I just applied it's really really gorgeous it's really beautiful that this was given to me by the brand uh, because uh, when I was in my makeup school it was given to us as a little bonus and uh, it's been ages that I have it and that I've never used it and it's such a mistake because it looks so beautiful now I'm just gonna take that off and I'm gonna do my under eye makeup on the makeup on my on my lower lash line. So I'm just gonna take the same colors, this one here and this one here, and I'm gonna run this with a, with a fluffy angled brush. I'm just gonna run this on my lower lash line. kind of really like this look so now I am gonna take another fluffy brush this one and I'm gonna take the dark color tempting this one it's like a, a black color and I'm just gonna take a little bit of this and apply it here on my on my outer V outer corner and a little bit on the crease just to give even more dimension, even more depth, just a little bit, not too much, because I really want to keep it pinky. Mm -hmm. 
So now with my, where is it? With my L'Oreal Super Super Liner Perfect Slim. It's a liquid liner. I am gonna apply, like run this. Uh, I'm not gonna do a cat eye. I'm just really gonna trace a thin line as thin as possible on uh, my low, uh, my upper lash line here. I'm just gonna do that because I'm gonna apply false lashes, and I want my false lashes to to have a base, basically. Now I'm taking a nude, beige nude color that I'm going to apply uh, on my waterline. And now it's just time for your lashes. So curl, mascara and false lashes. So you don't have to apply false lashes obviously, but it's just the time you do all this. Okie dokie. Okay, so I applied my Huda Beauty false lashes that are extremely dramatic, but I love them very, very much. So now what I'm gonna do is that I'm gonna apply this white peach color. This one, I'm gonna take my flat brush and apply this on my brow bone to give a bit of highlight to my eyes. I love those lashes. I'm so not used to wearing so, such like dramatic lashes, but I love them so much. They, they look so gorgeous and they I feel like they really make your eyes look so beautiful. And the quality of them is really good too. So now I am gonna take a mix of this white pitch and this luscious color here. So I'm gonna mix these two together and I'm gonna use them as my highlighter, like guys, as my inner corner highlighter shades now I am going to do my lips um, I was thinking of applying this lip lacquer by Makeup Forever. I have never really wear this yet, so I don't know how it's gonna look. I hope it's gonna look well, like good. It's gonna look good, I hope. I'm first gonna line my lips with just the outer part of my lips just to get a little bit more, just to give a little bit uh, like a better shape to my uh, lips. So I'm taking this Makeup Forever Aqua Lip Lip Liner. It's a nude lip liner. Okay, so there you go. This is the finished look. I really hope that you like it. As always, please, 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 if you like it, please subscribe to my channel and give this video a thumbs up. And please let me know what you want to see next. Really important for me. Let me know what type of videos you want to see next. And I hope you're all going to have a wonderful day and I'll see you very soon. Bye. Thank you for watching. Bye.